Hey there and welcome back dear friends and deep thinkers to pressure. We have captured a lot here following a claim that we had and we've distributed it to keep the many branches of the oak and to maybe spread riddleism here. <clears throat> Our next goal is definitely um, gaining some faith because we might want to reform the riddleism faith. There's only one kid in faith missing oh my goodness me and then yeah we need some prestige that's something and then yeah first we need some prestige then we can do that proclaim the terra mariana that's something that we want to reach and how are we going to start on that goal that seems a big 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 goal so we need the high chiefdom of latigallians the High Chiefdom of Kuronia and the High Chiefdom of Livonia, but we don't want to we don't want to attack our fellow Vidalists. So, what shall we do? We're going to look here, and we can see that the, all of this is in uh, High Chieftain Milas of Livonia's realm. This one is in uh, Jersica's uh, Maritis realm. So. That is already Vitalis, but these we can capture. So that was the Latigallians, and we have Coronia, and you can see here a friend controlling this, that's nice, and these also controlling this. So Samogetia, Coronia is fully Vitalis. We've got Livonia, and this guy is Ukonusko, this guy's Vitalis, thankfully, and this guy's also Ukonusko. So we're going to grab these counties first. So it's a, ra a rather long-term goal to control this. Um, Defenders of Vievas is also something that we would that we would like. Um, as you can see, we need another powerful vassal. With 60 opinion of us, then we could become defenders of Dievas. Defending the faith. Many Vitalist warriors in your realm become holy warriors. And we could uh, get the Hall of Heroes, where heroic warriors can meet and organize. That would be also very perfect. That's why we kind of also want another... Um, another bigger vassal and of, of course founding a holy order would also be cool but we need first the kingdom or an empire so that's out of reach for now uh consecrating the bloodline yeah not not really not really um we we first need to organize the faith uh, reform the faith that is so what are we going to do now is um yeah, of course we want to we want to reach this goal and we want to raid probably. Uh, let's have a look at our raiders and at least the men at arms have filled up again. We could uh, raise another another regiment of them. We could raise the levies too, but we could also leave the levies at home for plundering alone. These men at arms will suffice. Uh, of course, we want another rally point, but we first want to look where there's something to plunder. We have some loot to be had here, but that's now <laughs> our realm. So we need to look at another place here, maybe. Yeah, there's some loot to be had. Is there some loot in Plock? There's definitely some loot in Plock, which means... Yeah, there's also... Dobrichin, and there's also some loot to be had in Dobrichin. Dobrichin is now ours, actually, so uh, it's plock time, I guess. So we'll move that over to here. We'll, uh, yeah, let's see. We only want. The men at arms has raiders. And the question is can we raise these and then declare them raiders?
I think we can. Chieftain Strush of Lechishka, it would lead them. Hmm, I think we would lead them ourselves, of course. And let's go over to Plock. Can we even do this? <coughs> I think we would. Do we have a truce? No, not really. So. Pl do we plunder now? Nah, it, there's a bug that we sometimes do not see this plundering. Nah. Okay, yeah, we, we were at war with him previously, so apparently we cannot plunder now. The question is, can we plunder like here? And it seems like we can, so let's just hurry over there. Oh, we can also look at our former victories. They are all here. We did well. Sometimes they were really gruesome battles, though. So now let's go over. Woo -hoo -hoo. Prestige is suffering. Yeah, we need some loot and we need some prestige. Doing this only with the men at arms now, which is probably for the best. Mm. Not defending enough, apparently. Not so good. Now we've planted here a bit. Um, something to be had here. That's great. Let's go over. Oh, what, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing here? Army of tr what, 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 are they raiding or what? Are they really raiding? Hmm. I think we could maybe go back here. But they're a neutral army. What are they doing here? It's probably between vassals, right? Oh, it's just not interfere. We have our ongoing raiding here. And we're getting better. We can live off the land. Raid speed and supply capacities increase. Nice. That's exactly what we need for this lifestyle. Oh, oh, they're coming, but we have a better army commander and way higher quality. So there's some hope we can do this. Woo, ho, 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 ho. Galindas was slain. Not good, not good. Come on, keep the quality. We can do this. Oh, God. I think we can beat them. We can beat them to the last warrior. Ooh, that was a costly win. It was a win though, and we got a lot, a lot of prestige for that. Let's go back, quick. Oh god. That's terrible. That's so terrible. Uh, is there more that we can plunder? They will surely come back now and try to beat us. Let's return. It's also getting cold here. Yeah, we don't want to do this. We went back. This is not Pokal, is it? No, that's the tribe of Warm Detton. What is going on there in Warm Detton? Chieftain Garonas is there. He's in a war with. Chieftain Sergonis of Galindia, the Pomesane. Oh, okay. He's kind of in trouble or something. Or not in trouble, anyways. Faction has disbanded. That's good. Oh, let's disband the army. We have to recover a bit. At least we're in positive prestige again. The sick mayor. Oh, no, 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 no. We, we want to keep our mayor. So we've raided a bit. Uh, we might actually go over here and try to raid Denmark one day. Once we can reach them, 
We cannot, though, really reach them at the moment because we cannot raid over the seas. Let's see what we can do here. Um, a powerful vassal expects a county position. Chieftain Klukis of Lomsia, our son, he's a powerful vassal indeed. Okay. Um, hmm. What could he do? I mean, he could become our marshal, but Garonus still does that. So marshal is definitely an option. Oh God, Achilles, our chancellor and champion. Um, yeah, maybe maybe our son will become our chancellor, right? How about Klukis? Yeah, Aurelius is way better at that, but hey. Klukis is powerful. Achilles will be fired. That's okay. We want our son in. We want him in. It's gonna be good. The bill hook. Mm, yeah, we still get something from that. We have a few champions. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. Let's see if we can construct something. Something else. Building here. Can we upgrade the palisade? Ah, we would need more prestige. Funny. But maybe we can celebrate? Not really. All right, all right. I'll just wait a little bit then. We want to see what happens here. And after that, we'll go raid again. Uh, because need to recover. What a fighter that was, though. So that in-vassal fighting, um, that's Chieftain Sergonis. He's losing that war against Gauronas. Gauronas, our half-brother, is winning the war. That's it. It's really interesting. He's really strong militarily. It's quite crazy. I mean, I wonder, will he, will he attack us one day? <laughs> Also, is, is there something? No, no, no. We just need more prestige. Ah, I think we've recovered now. Yeah, that's great. Uh, we could create a next... Um, a next regiment. And we'll add pikemen now. Just adding a little bit of flexibility. And... Then we want to go raid. But, but whom are we going to raid? Um, Hrodna has been a little bit of a plague, so and I think it's all looted. It's been looted thoroughly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's only three gold to be had there. That's pretty terrible. Uh, how about Pomerania? They are big, and we're kind of against the big ones. Wow, look at that. That would have 24 loot. That 15. We'll try that. We'll try that. Uh, they are strong though, let's see. Pomerania. <laughs> but they don't have many um many professional troops. Oh, although <laughs> they have good allies. And they have onagers already. <laughs> yeah, we definitely have to raid them if we can. Um let's just uh raise the men at arms for now. Here, okay, that's fine too. Sarma has religious construction. Nice new temples established. Now let's let's go over here instantly. There's three gold to be had here. Um, and we'll raid. And that will be uh, kind of oh, you look here. Here's another three. We'll take that too. <gasps> Judith has died in my dungeons. Mm -hmm. Who is in our dungeons anyways? Are they useful? Wow, that guy would be... He's a lunatic, but he would be an excellent knight. If he converts... 
he will be a good knight. I mean, he's, he's a little bit of uh, uh, special, but Peter Vlastimirovich would also be an acceptable knight. Um, he's a compassionate lackey. Apparently generous, diligent, shy. Convert and become our knight. They joining us? Yeah, we've got twelve knights now. No choice but to accept your conditions for my release. And he kind of likes us now. It's because of the great music we have uh, made. Ah, uh, yeah, he's. Not not happy with the conversion and the recruitment. But we'll be good with raiding. Ah, encourage development even. Good, good, good. And now uh ooh, this. Maybe that's better. So we won't won't lose so much. Raid, raid, raid. Maybe we'll become a legendary raider. I kind of need supplies. That's not good. They're coming in. They're coming in. Um, I think we need to do something. No, we'll not flee. Rally point needs to be here. Raise everyone. Uh... Wait, can we raise everyone as raiders? Raise all as raiders. Here we go. Our Ensatz army is coming. Charge! Charge! Come on over! Come on over! Yeah. Who is that? Klukis of Lomcha? That's our son. He's a vindictive paragon. He's scarred. He's an experienced fighter, come on. Help us, son. We need your help against these barbarians here. First, we'll take this guy down. First, we take Manhattan. Opportunity phase is in transition. Opportunity, ah. In the Iberian struggle, okay. Is there some plundering here going on? No, mm, that's good. Wow, they they're really beating each other up. Uh, can we go over here? Not really. We can go. That would be a good tribe here. Equal strength. I will come after them, then we'll make this ours. Come on, we can do it. Hopefully. Charge! Charge! There's a lot of loot to be had. Now, taste our blades. We must devastate Pomerania. Great stuff. Now let's take all that loot. We've gained a rival. Chieftain Alexander of Tarno. The feud broke out between House Legion and House Wilkes. Aha, he's a Polish adulterer. <laughs> Tarnow it is. Aha. Is, is he the leader of these? Mm-hmm. The populists, that's not good. So the populists often complain when you raid too much. Because so many men are lost. Fire and blood, bring me bounteous plunder. They're gonna devastate everything here. Ah, there's the tribe of Vulch. Uh, there's another 15 to be had. What's here? Ah, oh, that's so far away. We don't want to be so far away. Because there's a couple of them going on here. So we want to take this.
and plunder. We captured Chieftain Barnim's son, Jiri. Quick. Let him go for money. Don't want these little kids to die. Oh, the billhook is in danger. Mm. The toy fowl. Mm. It's okay. It's okay. Gotten a lot. Uh, this settlement has three. We'll use this as the retreat raiding. Oh, yes. Oh, we'll have to recover from that for quite a while. But it will bring us bounteous plunder. Yeah. Every city that you um, that you raid, you have a chance to get an event with 30 extra loot. Which is why raiding that is pretty, uh, pretty good. Oh, the tribe of Plock even. Can we now? Uh, I think we still we still have uh, a truce. So, oh, there's so much going on. I hope I hope we're good. Hey, we got a lot of raid loot delivered. That's fantastic. And we're very pious now. I wonder. Unite and disband, return home. Good, good, good. Now, let's see. Let us see. We could now reform the faith. Whoa, let me, let me think about that, sh about that shortly. I'm really looking forward to that. Six of eight vessels will convert. Why only six of eight? It's because we have two people that are not Vidalists. They're around here. Um, that guy. Oh, that reminds me. Mm, should we? Uh, we cannot. We cannot make him convert because he's a kid. <sighs> but maybe we could marry this guy. Right, 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 right. Tsugutsu. Tsugutsu Wilkes and Chieftain Imran. Yeah, I mean, she's hunchbacked, but she's a good one. She's a good one. How about you get a chieftain, little one? Little pensive one? Sure, right? Yeah, that's gonna be good. And Violun, mm hmm, have our son here. How is he doing, by the way? His spouse, he's got kids. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, then we've got Dobrichin. And that guy's also still in the wrong faith. He might accept that. Let's ask him. Let's ask him. Maybe we can do do it like that, right? We'll see. We'll see. Ah, okay. Um, he's also Vedalist now. Excellent. I see the wisdom of your faith, but I hope you understand what a long winding path it is from the darkness into the light. Perhaps if you promised me support in whatever way I need, the journey would be an easier one. But we have, uh, he gets a weak hook, but we'll convert a lot of people, like his family members, that is, that guy, that one, that's not a guy, that's someone, just, and probably his wife, mm. He's young though, so it would be good to convert him. I accept for the good of vitalism everywhere. And now, and now we need to think about 
the conversion. Uh, I mean, the reform. We're old and grey already. How old are we? 54? Well, yeah, that's that's the grey thing. We're probably kind of a legend now. For our vitalist friends, though. Let's see. Let's see what we can reform. Let me ponder a bit and then we'll have a look together. So, what I think is that we should try to get a little bit more piety. So we can change a little bit more. For example, why would witches um, be criminal when they are just... Um, maybe the wise women of the woods? Um, the reason for this is... The reason we want to make maybe all of this a little bit less criminal is that we are not just or something, we're arbitrary. We, we kind of... It's a sin for widowless and we so we're not really... Um, everyone has judged us for it and we don't like to judge people, right? So, I mean, we're a holy warrior. We want to bring out widowlism, but uh, we also kind of don't care. Um, we just don't care. So we want to get a little bit more faith. We're feeling fine. We can take this risk and um, we'll do what we can. And let's, let's just see how we can be a little bit more pious. So we have also the support to reform the faith a little bit more. Um, and if we, if we feel bad, we might just reform the faith to fulfill one of our lifetime goals, so to say. Let's see how our, our yeah, 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 yeah. Um, uh, let's, let's give us one more regiment of pikemen here. And maybe we can also build something. Not ready so far, not ready to iron poker with. We can now upgrade the Palisades. Let's do that. So, let our the raiders recover a bit. Oh. Mm, our neighbor won against Chieftain Pergrubius. Against the Samogitian in the Chieftain of Skalovia. Does this mean we have... have we have now lost this... This little tribe to uh, to Samogitia. That's not good. I don't like this. That was our half-brothers. But hey, it's a fair game. We weren't in involved. Food. Targets of ire. Though I doubted it at first, I'm becoming convinced. Through the gossip of Kor, the chieftain Alexander wants my head. All because of foolishness. All of Wilkes is game to him by their association to me, and this hatred has seeped from the head down throughout his entire abhorrent family. Uh, we could start a house, uh, a house lesion. They are of another, of another faith. So House Alexander will regret this. We have a nemesis now, okay. Let's pin the nemesis. Jal Wagen too, but, but Chieftain Alexander of Lechian. Where where are you, man? Here in Tarno. Here in Tarno, our nemesis. We could challenge him to a fight. Would that be good? A might be. He's a torturer. So he's dreadful. He's kind of far away, so I don't know if I would... I mean, we could raid him as a first step. Mm, yeah. That's maybe something. Is he old or something? Yeah, he's definitely also old, but we feel strong. Um, let's actually repair our our weapon. And we can challenge him to a duel then. 
the bill hook. Let's repair that. Mm. Challenge him to a fight. He refuses our challenge. We gained prestige and he loses prestige. Ah, that's an insult to us. It's an insult to us. Um, let's see. So we are feuding. Uh, what can we do then? We should... Powerful vassal expects... Oh, chieftain celebrate of Dobrichin expects a council position. What are you good at? You're a good steward. Chieftain Sagonis is there still. We cannot just throw him out, even though he's a dishonorable villain. And we'll just go to Tarno now. And declare war on this man. He's got two allies. <laughs> He's got a duchy. A duchy of Vistulania. Why do we want his county so we can throw him out? He's got two allies, but this, uh, I mean, we're diligent and patient, but we're also a holy warrior and a gallant. It's a feud. Let's declare that a war. Ah, uh, not yet, not yet, not yet. We must first prepare. So every, everyone must recover. And we'll set our rally point. I mean, we're patient, remember? So we'll, we'll definitely prepare, like, we'll start our journey here. Let's see what we can do. Alliance formed with Baron Dao Mantas because he's now a ruler. Of Grobin, yeah, he's married our daughter. How are you doing? Ah, that's the little granddaughter. Nice, nice. Oh my god, what what happened to her? God, she died in childbirth. Uh not good. Saul is uh, kind of... She's a leper now. <laughs> ah, that's his concubine. Okay. Okay, let's, let's see. Let's see. What the heck? I wanted to choose myself. Okay, let's see. Um, hmm. Located in Natangia. So you're married to him, and you've got a son who is also frail. Uh, Gardinas. Um, what would he need? Uh, he 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 better be a steward. Uh, he's just frail and, and has no character. We'll see what he wants to do. Chieftain Alvedas is good. Um, let's have a look at the others, right? Chieftain Aurelis. He's also doing well. Bajorus needs to find a spouse. What is he good at? Um, he's he's gonna be an okay diplomat, I guess. <laughs> Let's find him a spouse. Mm -hmm. Half for it, Holmer's Dottier Hammer. And no, we want a Vidalist. We're a holy warrior, so we want Vidalists only. And the age difference should not be so big. If possible, we have Weslikan. We have Giedre. Yeah, an alliance with the chieftain of Yatwagi. I mean, she's gluttonous, but hey. What can you do? There's worse things. She's a stable woman. And she will not die of hunger. Take her, my son, and be happy.
Then we've got to go to Wilkes. Yeah, you're betrothed already to this chieftain. And we have Best Presum Wilkes. Might become a diplomat. Um, who will you marry? Draw lines with Jersica. With Memo. Mm -hmm. I mean, she's content. He's brave and wrathful. Wrathful, sinful. Content's definitely a, a good thing to have, so. You, you, you try to get, you try to get her. Uh, Alexander became our rival. Yeah, 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 we got the feud. Pergrubius. Yeah, yeah, nice. Chieftess Marite. And we would also like a new concubine if there's anyone. We got Jaroslava, our new courtier. The lunatic. I mean, she's content. Greedy and gluttonous and very intriguing. And a lunatic. I'm not sure this would be good, but maybe... Uh, we have... Oh, we have a guest. Oh, he's an experienced fighter, really? You come here. Can we... Ah, Yadvagi. Ah, that's, that's what happened. Yadvagi has shrunk. Okay. Try before Drona. Look at him. Is he becoming Vitalist? No. But this county here is Vitalist. We need to get that back. To Vitalism too. We have so much to do. Hmm. Let's contact Curonia too. Codere, do you, you have more of these now. Mm -hmm. She's 54. 43. <laughs> ah, 54. Yeah, he won't give up his high chief, just the son. Daughter and ward. Way, way too young. Then we've got Livonia. Hmm. No, no, no. Jersica, yeah, she is Vitalist. She's got Arthur. Well, is 71. No. Courtsier is Tsiguzi. She will not come. Yeah, it's terrible. It's terrible. We we will have to We will have to really try with Jaros Lava. The content lunatic. But she needs to convert first. We have certain standards. Convert to Vidalism. And she did that. Right, so okay. She's a little fat, but we just told our son that fat is not really bad, so we'll take her as a concubine. To uh, interesting times, I guess. To interesting times. And maybe we should try to seduce her. That's something. Uh, oh, she's a novice physician, even. She already got three children. Oh my goodness me. They are now here, too. Oh, can they convert? No. All right. All right. Uh, yeah, maybe that goes too far. Yeah, we don't want to uh, be bad to our wife and maybe seducing the the concubine is a little bit too much attention 
We'll just wait for some luck. Tr a trusty mare. Aha. Uh -huh. He could train her. But yeah, she, she needs to work on her endurance. Charlotte took to her training well and results could be seen instantly. Yeah, we, we now have an enduring horse. That's great. Tano, 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 Tano. We've got enough money. We could do anything. No, we cannot actually. Let's see if we can recover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It gets better. It gets better. Soon we'll have more pikemen too. And then we'll see how the prestige really goes now. Gotta be interesting. House is feuding, indeed. Is there more available for us against this man? No, not at all. Marek's friendship, who's that? A courtier of High Chieftess Tatiana, a treacherous ravener? What? Uh. Aha! And peasant leader, while his numerous attempts to curry my favor have not gone unnoticed, I cannot feel but irritated by Merrick's sudden interest in me. Anything is obsessed his desire to impress me and his blundering displays of fabricated affection have only made me dislike him more. Why can't we not leave me in peace? Uh, this figured man with lover's pox. God, the most creepy stalkers we have there. The most creepy stalkers, and there's something we could do. Ah, we could host a feast. We could develop the capital. Yeah, let's develop the capital. That's always some fun. Uh, it's also a lot of stress, but we enjoy. Let's celebrate this, and then we'll look after our rival. Long houses constructed in Zambia too. Good, good, good. Um. What can we have here? War camps. Let's construct these. A cheery gathering. The guests are gathered in the great hall. Lords and ladies from the near and far reaches of the realm. The mood is bright and spirits are high as the feast begins. Welcome, friends. Let's celebrate before the war and maybe after. A laudable effort as the feast's underway and our guests are eating and drinking merrily better and approaches Tsuguzi and me at the great table. This is a marvellous feast. All well, my compliments to the hosts. Ah, that's our daughter. A spineless lackey. <laughs> she got a kid at least. Oh, he's all so frail. <laughs> but we can give him a focus now. Um, yeah, you, you better... I don't know. You must do everything you can. Mm. Tiguzi deserves all the credit. We love our wife. She's a soulmate. Disaster strikes the vine. We cracked open the next barrel. It's gone bad. It's all gone bad. He's still raging, but without drink, the mood is sure to dwindle at a cruel pace. Um, the wine merchant should still be in town. We'll just buy more buy our way out of this. Let's see what we can get here. Sappers. Aha. Siege progress is faster. That's very helpful. Indeed, very, very helpful. So my guests depart. I have my wife Tikutsi to thank for much of the success of the feast. Feel nothing but gratitude as she sees the last few guests. Of. Until next time. 20 opinion for us. But Joris comes of age. Aha. He has not really learned the intricacies of diplomacy, but he's made a working theory of it. Huh, they grow up so fast. He should have become a warrior, really. But at least he's just and brave and content. He's a true man. A true man. Not very intriguing though, but maybe his wife will save him there. She's bossy. <laughs> Zealous. Let's hope for the best. Alliance expired with Velnius of Tsumachi. <gasps> Our friend has died! 
I'll go? No. Huh. Valnius. No. No. I can only hunt in two years. Hmm. Need something to distract us. Wait, there was something to distract us. There was something to distract us. Whoa! He's got so many allies now. I don't know. That's kind of too much for now. We we will have to make our way out of this in another way. There was something else we wanted to do. The tribe of Rodna here is still Vidalist. Can we attack this man? It seems like we can. And we want Rodna from him. We could take the whole duchy. That might even be better. It will cost us, but it will also gain us something. We could even do this alone. Yeah, let's actually declare war. The High Chieftain of Rodna. We can distribute that again and convert more to Vitalism. Good. High Chieftain Beatrice Love. Raise our armies. Is our army? No, that's a son. That's our army. Go over here and our son will go to the capital. Oh, our son will follow up these guys, I guess. Son will go adventuring. He has to prove himself. Come on, son, you can do this. Charge after them. We can get them. Oh, Jal Ragnar has an Anglo-Nordic hybrid. What's under siege? My goodness, there's something under siege. Dobrich Chin. By the chief, chief of Metsovia. Hmm. They're coming in here. Can we catch them? They're going back. We're doing what we can here. They're going up there. Maybe we can catch these. Bastards. Whoa, there's a sizable army on, a, on their way. Come on now, catch them in the forests. Uh oh. We took something here. Good, good. And now let's go back. Oh, our son got them to fight. Who's that? Ah, High Chieftain Grichesler against our son Chieftain Klukis. He's a great army leader, but he's not that prow prowessive. Um, yeah, he's not that strong. Still, this is a good fight. Wow, so much glory he brings us. So much glory. So you can go back. Uh, yeah. We need to control Rod now. Let's go back. We'll fight ourselves in this fight. Who's that High Chieftain Borislav of Mazovia? Ha! We take this personally. 
You're one of these raiders. You've captured Stunny's love. And we'll go here to Novo Grudok. Oh no. I mean, Goldas is no longer a ruler. Hmm. Not that great. We've gained another rival. Ah. Chieftains Dobron Jäger hated you since ever you became the head of House Wilkes. A consequence of a feud between Legion and Wilkes. So she's now our nemesis because she's in Tarnov now. Alexander's died. Okay. We can unpin him then. Unless he might uh, come back from the dead. Ha ha! We've captured Vyacheslav again. Mr. Ruslanovich, this is your end. Celebrat has become our marshal. My goodness me. Oh God! Oh, it cannot be Firefire. Why? But maybe we can exchange him for our, for our steward? Oh God. No, I mean the price we paid. He's a convert now. <sighs> can we can we give him the job of the steward? Swap. Yeah, that seems better. That seems okay now. Celebrate. And Sergonis is our marshal now. Mm. I'm not sure. We want Garonis back. Anyways. Oh, our son. Cluck is of Lomja. Uh, Garonus is powerful though. We need him. Oh. Let's just wait. 11 is, is probably okay. 11 is probably okay. Okay, now. I mean, these are all old men. They will probably die someday. Uh, yeah, we're absolutely not old, right? Oh god, we're ailing already. We are ailing. And we feel it, we kind of feel it coming, probably, out there. And one night uh, at, at the campfire, we decide to, oh gods, um, we decide to actually, oh my goodness me, um, We decide to keep it simple, right? Uh, so we will not change much. And we will try to... Uh, bring the war down. Okay, may maybe witchcraft will only be shunned. So let's quick, quick, quickly do everything we can to win this war because we don't really feel that good. Strategical impasse. I'm sitting around the map table with Chieftain Klukis and Chieftain Ulenix discussing our strategy for the ongoing war. And they are struggling, but... Uh, so Klukis wants to charge the enemy directly. And Ulenix sits back and advocates for us to secure critical locations. It's both good. We can employ both strategies. I've What? To the vile High Chieftain Bajoris. I've lately heard of your disputes with that hysterical doxy. Chieftain Dobronjega of Tarnov, a most contemptible excuse for a woman. Given our mutual interests, I'm sure we'll get along well, friend. Oh... Um, Sign Mr. Voy. Messengers are so unreliable. I don't know. I eagerly await the opportunity to discuss this. 
This is a low play by a low player. You're no friend of... Who is this man? Her Chancellor. Hmm. Are we like that? Are we like the underhanded rogue type? I think we're a knight. Nah. You're no friend of mine. Yeah, he's also Slovansky Prada. You're no friend of mine. Instead, we'll make some peace. Yes, yes, we will do that. Victory! Good, good, good. So be it. Let's disband our troops. And let's see if we can indeed now still reform our faith. And we can. We changed witchcraft to just to shunned because uh, we don't think the, the wise women should be punished. Maybe we could even accept it. Yeah, we could accept it. So that's the one thing of our arbitrariness. We would have changed like that criminality, but witches were always kind of, we thought they were friendly, friendly and nice women of the woods, like knowing a lot about nature. And that's uh, what always like made us uneasy. We, we don't want to burn witches. That's what Christians do. And we're not Christians. So um, we reform the faith. Witchcraft will be accepted. That's the only change because we feel our death coming and we want to complete this because we're the holy warrior. We want to crown ourselves with that. Make a good, good deed. And yeah, we just don't care enough for, for more changes because we're arbitrary. Let's reform the faith. Can never be changed once it's been reformed. Yeah, we're, we're happy about this. We're happy about the sanctity of nature, ancestor worship and uh, better childbirth practices. We also want no head of faith. No, no, no. Let's create the new Baltic Vidalist faith. That would be it. Um, yeah, Mila endorses us. Choose our name. Oh, if we changed it, okay. No, no. So this is a new vitalism. This is old vitalist, and there might be some problems with that. But a lot has happened, and uh, a lot will will do. A lot will change. It's a big step for a smallish. Yeah, not so small, but yeah, pretty run-of-the-mill country in the middle of everything. We're pretty content we could reach this in our lifetime. We would never have expected this. But uh, it's something we really wanted to accomplish, to reform our faith. Mm. Now there's a couple of... Uh, counties that we want to distribute let's maybe start with this one that even has palisades that's good so we'll grant it to so does our son have lands no but Joris Wilkes has no lands mm. we want this in our dynasty Bajoras. Yeah, good Bajoras. You'll become the ruler there. Volkovisk. Great stuff. Many branches of an oak. 
Then we've got Novo Grudok. We'll need a strong ruler there as well. Ah, he's wrathful and brave. He'll surely become a great warrior. Best Prism Wilkes. Every one of our, our sons should become something something good in our lifetime. And the Grodno we have. There's another tribe here. We've got a lot of chieftains. Mm -hmm. Maybe our pensive grandson. Because yeah, because we feel we feel ailing, right? He's only our grandson, but let's grant him that title. It's good, it's good. His father will help him. I'm pretty sure. Hmm. What else is there to do? You can usurp the high chieftain. We can negotiate an alliance with Chieftain Bajoras. Good. Yeah, we'll do that. We're, we're still feuding. Hmm. We could declare wars. Yeah, we don't want to do that right now. Can usurp the High Chieftain of Rodna. That would cost us much. And we don't want to invest that right now. We will probably do that, though, once we have the money. So that's another, another goal. Maybe to create these High Chieftains, or Duchies, as they are. Let's also have a look at the realms. We still, we cannot pass this. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. So, we have grown. You can see the forests here. Um, we have grown along the lines of suppressed vitalists and of... Um, yeah, kind of feuds. We will probably go and attack Tarno one day. For our foes, the axe for our friends, perseverance. Also a nice uh, motto for House Legion. So, she's definitely pinned. Jalwagen of Smallland too. So there are some things we want to do. Maybe raid a little bit more for money. Maybe other things. Um, this was definitely something because Hrodna always came over and raided our fellow Widdalists, so we had to defend them. In, an, in a rather offensive way. So we've made our new organized Baltic faith here. Holy sites here are still... Yeah, that's... What happened to Pokaini? Oh, it's old Vidalist now. Okay, so um, the fight begins again a little bit. We now have to convince the others to become new Vidalists. That's another part of our legacy. We are not yet dead, but um, our body is not really that strong anymore. All the relentless fighting has cost us. Oh, but look. Look at our deeds and uh, shiver. Um, yeah, what? Yeah. So, one day we'll rest under a great oak and and see our dynasty's oak and be proud of them. Until next time, my friends and deep thinkers. Until next time and happy gaming. This is Manuel Khan signing out. Have a great time until then.